For my diamond and pearl slash platinum uh, opening day, I'm going to be opening up this sealed box of base platinum. So a uh, pretty awesome box. There's tons of really cool level X's in this set. I bought this box from a, a place called Potomac. I think, I think it's Potomac Wholesale Distributors or something like that. And they've got a lot of other Pokemon sets. Um, they don't really keep a certain number of things in stock. So, uh, yeah. But they gave out really good deals. And I actually have a bunch of these uh, loose packs for sale as well. Um, $3 per loose pack. Um, and as well as the Magnezone promo box that they all came in. So I figured it would be a good time to open these up and um, see if I had any interest in, um, you know, hopefully get some good pulls. And if anyone else is hoping for uh, good pulls as well, maybe they'd be interested in some packs. So... Legit box, we've got the Pokemon symbol there, and yeah, uh, there's not really much else to say, except for hope I pull some level X. I don't know what the, the level X ratio is in a box, but I think it's only like one or two or something, so um, yeah, let's hope for some good stuff. So, first pack. And I'm not doing a very good job of looking up what the order of the rare and reverse are before I open the pack. So I'm going to have to kind of sneak this off camera to see what they are. And it looks like they are the, the third and fourth one. So the same um, trick as the current sets. So one, two, three, one, two. And we have Mareep, Skull Fossil, Ralts. Piplup, cool Piplup too, with the artwork wise. Mischievous, Looker's Investigation, Cacturn, and My Diana. My Reverse is nice, Lucario. And my Rare is Toxicroak. Pretty cool. This uh, Toxicroak uh, used to be a, not a big played card, but um, it was played. So this was. This set was in rotation when I started playing, so I'll probably be pointing out, you know, a lot of cards that, you know, whoa, I wish I had pulled this card back when I played kind of thing. Skuntank, uh, this was one that I tried in a fun, de fun, fun deck. Mareep, Skull Fossil, Ralts, Piplup. This pack is looking very similar to the last pack. Uh, that's a new one. Probapass, not really my favorite Pokemon. Miasma Valley. And hey, nice, a plus power, still legal. My reverse. Nice is a Lickitung. Creepy Pokemon overall, but still a nice pull. And my rare is Infernape. One, two. Puchiana, which uh, I love this Pokemon, but I hate the artwork on it. It's just all out of proportion and I don't like it. Turtwig, Torchic, Chansey, Lapras, Pokeball, Craniados, or Craniados, Cran whatever it is, and Power Spray. Uh, the, rem remembering that card back in the day where you could shut down your opponent's um, abilities. Or not abilities, powers. We have abilities now. Back then it was powers. My reverse is a love disc, which is a rare. Not the best rare ever, but uh, still nice to have a rare reverse. And my rare, ooh, first hollow of this set. So nice. Um, I remember running into this. Um, I only played against this card once, and it was in a it was a Kyogre Groudon Legend deck, um, where yeah, it uses the Dialga to to rearrange cards or something like that, and yeah, pretty it's pretty interesting. Shuppet, uh, I remember the Shuppet Donk decks where you use Fade Out and you put as much energy uh, or uh, do as much as you could with Expert Belt Plus powers and stuff like that, and then everything went to your hand. So that was a pretty cool deck. I, I think I lost to that one a few times too. Uh, Shuppet Donk, Puchiena, Turtwig. Torchic, Chansey, Probopass, Miasma Valley, and Plus Power, and again, very similar packs. Um, excellent pull with the Plus Power again, though. And my reverse is a Dunsparce. And my rare, 
<gasps> nice! Shaman level X. Probably one of my favorite level X's from this set. Um, just, uh, Shaman looks, uh, Shaman is just a really cool Pokemon. Um, pretty cool though that, uh, it's, uh, Revenge Seed, if a Grass Pokemon was knocked out, then uh, Shaman's attacks do 60 more. So, it's a nice little recovery card. So, first level X of the box. Let's hope we pull one more. Lotad, Armor Fossil, Vulpix, Torkoal, cool looking Torkoal. Perugly G. Uh, I remember this card being teched into some Lux Chomp decks. Um, chip off for 20, and if they're, they have six or more cards in your hand, you get to discard a number of their cards without looking until they have five or left. Luxchomp decks also ran a huge number of cards in their hand, so that was always a, that was just a nice disruption card. Cyrus, ah, that, the, the Cyrus, um, oh, I can't remember to think of the word, uh, the Cyrus chain, whatever you want to call it, um, just, that was such an awesome combination. Uh, searching for supporter, basic energy, and trainer with the Galactic's invention, so their power sprays, poke turns, all sorts of stuff. That was in really low energy cost decks too, because you always had something to search on an energy. Miss Magius and Monferno. My uh, reverse. Nice. Curlia. Uh, which the cat around here, or the kitten around here, is named Curlia, I'd like to point out. My rare is Ludocolo, or L Ludocolo, however, however you say the, the, the little pine, uh, pineapple guy's name. And speaking of Curlia, here she comes bounding into the room. I feel like she knew she was being talked about. Oh, but I guess she doesn't care. She just ran back out again. She's got a mouse. Toy mouse. Hunchkroji, Grimer, Lapras, Psyduck, Carnivine, Nice! Crobat G, another big card in the day. And Bronzong G, another amazing card back in the day. Houndoom G, my reverse, is a level max. Oh, wrong pile. And my rare is Gyarados G. Wurmple, Hapini, Squirtle, Cacnea, which who is very uh, fascinated by a leaf, <laughs> Swablu, Energy Gain, ah, so many memories, Monferno, and another level max, regular level max. My reverse is a Beautifly, which is a rare, very nice, and my rare is a Shaman. Uh, I remember using this Shaman. Um, Two for the Shaman level X. Uh, I think mainly I use it in like jump luff decks and stuff like that. Because uh, the other Shaman level X just adds HP to all your uh, grass Pokemon. Whoops, didn't mean to grab two packs there. But I feel like Energy Bloom the, or Energy Glow was the Shaman that I would use to get that level X out. Diglett, Lickitung. Ralts, Carnivine, Honchcrow G, another Crobat G, Seviper, and Zangoose. My reverse is a Vulpix. And my rare? <gasps> nice! Second level X of the box, Strapion. So, Tri Poison's pretty cool. Um, it's, yeah, you flip a coin. If heads, you choose one of the Pokemon. That Pokemon's now poisoned and three damage counters instead of just one in between turns. So an insane, insane poison. So two level X and we're only like 10 packs in. So maybe you pull more level X per box or maybe I just happened to pull them all in the beginning of the box. That'd be sad if I did because that would make the rest of the video kind of boring. Um, but we've only pulled one hollow so far. So hopefully lots more hollows to pull. Vulpix, Turtwig. Lapras, Ralts, Lotad, Cascoon, Pokedex, and another Power Spray. And my reverse is a Cacnea, the, another fascinated by a Leaf Cacnea. And my rare is Giratini. So let me take a minute and just stack up these commons and uncommons to get them out of the way.
Mischievous, Dunsparce, Combi, Ryolu, Krigatot, Cascoon, Pokedex, and another Power Spray. So, wow, that was, wasn't the last one a Pokedex? Yeah. Last pack was a Pokedex, Power Spray, and Cascoon, um, all in the same row. So, kind of, kind of a weird order that they keep sticking to. My reverse is Alteria, which, yeah, it, that's a rare. And my rare is Empoleon. So, kind of a cool looking Empoleon. I like the artwork on that one. With, uh, I know, I can see that's just like a leaf or seaweed or something, but it looks like that's a Staryu in the background. Kind of cool. One, two. Vulpix, Dunsparce, Skuntank, Torkoal, Shuppet. Sh uh, that's a cool looking shield on. Zangoose and Grottle. My reverse is a Miss Magius. And my rare is a Ninetales. So, <laughs> kind of weird. Still only one hollow, but we've got the two level X. But we've been pulling all different rares, so it'll be interesting to go back and take a look at this complete set and really see how many hollows uh, uh, or in, and non-hollow rares are in this set compared to each other. Torkoal, Perugliji, Chimchar, Turtwig, Skuntankji, Vigoroth, Silcoon, Shieldon, my reverse. Nice rainbow energy. Forgot that was in this set. Still playable today. And my rare is Bennett. And I remember using Bennett as a tech in um, Lux Chomp decks as well. Uh, this was a great, um, what, what was it mainly countered for? Uh, I'm trying to think now. It wasn't Gengar's. Forget what it was used for, but it was used to knock out something in one hit. Vulpix, Torkoal, Perugliji, Chimchar, Turtwig, Grottle, Wartortle, and Life Herb. Still legal. My reverse is a Torterra. Awesome artwork and a rare. And my rare, yay, another hollow. Palkia G. Beautiful card. So Dialga and Palkia are my only two hollows so far. So kind of cool that they're both uh, like legendary Pokemon. Swablu, Vulpix, Dunsparce, Skuntank, Torkoal, Curlia, Miasma Valley, and Probapass. My reverse is a Skull Fossil. And my rare is a Dustox, so another non-hollow. However, it is still a different uh, non-hollow rare than uh, what I've already pulled. So let me go ahead and stack these up again. And my little tower of packs is kind of falling forward. Oh, I tried to set them back up there, but they didn't really want to. Combi, Electric. I think that's the first Electric. Cacnea, Skitty. I think that's the first Skitty, too. So cool. Diglett. Awesome. Pokemon Rescue. I remember this card a lot. And Gyarados. And Memory Berry. This was an, uh, this is a card I actually never personally used, but it was really cool. Um, being able, I remember it mainly being used in like Flygon decks to be able to use the attacks of the Pokemon, um, like already evolved Pokemon, the attacks of like the basic and Sage one. And a Silcoon, a kind of a sad looking Silcoon, by the way. My reverse is a Grimer, and my rare is a Giratina, which is the different Giratina. So again, uh, another non-hollow, but still pulling uh, different non-hollows. So, uh, yeah, still cool. Swablu, Vulpix, Dunsparce, Skuntink, Torkoal, Life Herb, whoops, Grottle, and Primplup. My reverse is Bastiodon. I think, yeah, that's a rare. And my rare is another Palkia. So, again, I don't think we've run into any duplicates. Yeah, different Giratinas. Huh. 
so there's a lot of different rares in this set. I didn't realize until I started opening up everything how many there really were. And I think it's hilarious that I've pulled the same number of hollows as EXs. Two. <laughs> Squirtle, Cacnea, Swablu, Skuntank, Slackoth, Curlia, Miasma Valley, or Miasma Valley, however you say it, and Probopass. My reverse is a Cricutot. And my rare, nice, another hollow, Manectric. Um, which I remember this being a nice uh, tech Pokemon with Electric Barrier. It prevents all uh, damage done to your bench Pokemon, so it's a great bench protector. And it was only a stage one, so it wasn't too difficult to get set up either. That was a great tech in a lot of different decks. Remoraid, Torchic, Combi, Electric, Cacnea, Vigoroth, Flaffy, Octillery. My reverse is a War Turtle. Nice. And my rare is a Licky Licky. licky, licky. <laughs> Can't say there's too many L's in that name. Licky Licky. But again, a different non hollow rare. At least now the number of hollows has surpassed the number of level X's. Ryolu, Hapini, Wurmple, Lotad, Armor Fossil, Plus Power, Cascoon, and Broken Time Space. Oh, the memories with this card. Let's you evolve a Pokemon that you just played or evolve during that turn. So this was amazing for getting your Pokemon set up as fast as possible. And my uh, uh, reverse <laughs> is a Vigoroth. And my rare is Cricutune, another not hollow, but another different one. So, okay, let's just count really quick. So, three, six, nine, twelve, fourteen different non hollow rares so far. And we still have all these packs to open up. Three hollows, uh, two level X. So, huh, quite weird. Ralts, Piplup, Mischievous, Remoraid, Torchic, Shieldon, Bronzong, Cyrus. Ah, the memories. My reverse is a Combi. And my rare is Alteria. And I f no, I pulled the reverse one. I have not pulled the regular Alteria yet, I don't think. So, another non hollow rare, but, and I feel like a broken record, another different one. Skitty, Perugliji, Lotad, Torchic, Slackoth, Carnivine, Muck, and Poketurn. I thought Poketurn was in this set, so this is another huge card. It returned in any of your uh, your SP Pokemon directly to your hand. So, um, uh, so many, so many great combinations with that card. Um, uh, Garchomp. Luxray, you know, it's almost about to be knocked out, and oh, you just play Poketurn, and there it's gone. My reverse, nice, a rare Ninetales. And my rare is a Blissey, and I, this was another big uh, uh, card. Blissey with Nurse Call, um, you discard a card from your hand, and if you do, you can remove two damage counters from one of your Pokemon. Um, this was great in uh, lots of decks that were meant to tank, so like Steelix, stuff like that, where it just helps to heal that damage off. Mischievous, Remoraid, Torchic, Combi, Electric, Combuskin, Level Max, and I think that's the first Cacturn. My Reverse, nice, an energy gain. This would have been an amazing pull back in the day. And my Rare, Awesome! Another hollow! Shaman hollow! Beautiful card, too. Just, it's the landform shaman, so the little fat one that looks like a hedgehog. Diglett, Puchiana, Carnivine, Piplup, Lickitung. Nice! Another Poketurn! Pokemon Rescue. Another great card, and Miss Magius, my reverse, is a mock. 
I already pulled the Grimer too, so that went well with it. And my rare is a Love Disc. And I pulled the Reverse Love Disc, but I haven't pulled the rare yet. So, um, yeah, I, I really want to go back and look at this set now and just, um, geez, I must have pages of rares. At least, we're on, probably around two pages of just rares. First Tauros, excellent. Combi, Squirtle, Nose, this is a different Nose Pass too, so nice, two new cards in this pack. Ryolu, Vigoroth, Flaffy, and Octillery, and I don't know if I've actually pulled an Octillery yet or not. My reverse is a Carnivine, and my rare, nice, Skyform Shaman Hollow. So I'm doing really well, I think, with the Hollows, unless everything in here, is, all the Hollows are just amazing. The the really good Manectric, the Legendaries, the Alga Palkia, both forms of Shaman. Um, yeah, just lots of good stuff. And we still have several more packs to go. Lapras, Tauros, Combi, Squirtle, Nosepass, Galactic HQ. I think that's the first one of that one, too. Um, which was always interesting. Uh, this is a, actually a really interesting stadium. Whenever you evolve your Pokemon, uh, or you, whenever your opponent evolves... A no, it's whenever either player evolves. You have to put two damage counters on that Pokemon. So it's a really great card for you to play when you're pretty much set up and ready to go, uh, or if you play a deck like uh, SPs that didn't evolve, to really slow down your opponent. Level Max and Looker's Investigation. My reverse is a Cyrus. Oh, this would have been the best pull during back back in the day. Oh, Cyrus, especially for people that wanted to rev their entire deck out. You know, people were looking for like four Cyrus, four rev Cyrus, four rev Pokéturn, four rev E Game, four rev Power Spray, the whole set. And my rare, hey, it's a first duplicate, Toxicroak G. So it took. I think we've got less than 10 packs left, and it took all this time to finally hit a duplicate. So I'm pretty happy with those odds. Um, we'll probably be, be hitting a few more duplicates in these upcoming packs. Um, like I said, I think we kind of got lucky in the beginning, showing the, e the level X's early, but uh, yeah, hopefully we'll pull a few more hollows. Remoraid, Grimer, Mareep, Piplup, Cacnea, Lookers, Flaffy, and Zangoose. My reverse is nice. This has been a nice pull in the day, too. Memory Berry. And my rare, a Giratina Hollow, the Let Loose one. This was, yeah, this was a major disruption card, too. When you played it, um, both of you shuffled your hand in and drew, um, I think it says, up to four cards. Uh, so that was a really great card. Uh, you know, it's like the modern-day Judge, but they didn't have a Judge back then, so... Uh, Let Loose was just great in Disruption decks. Chimchar, Turtwig, Skuntank G, Mareep, Skull Fossil, Muck, Pokedex, and I think that is the first non-hollow, or yeah, Rainbow Energy. I pulled the Reverse, so that's kind of a nice addition. My Reverse is a Rare Giratina. Really cool. And my Rare is a Golduck, which I haven't pulled this one yet. So I'm definitely thinking there's like two pages of hollows in this set, or, or non-hollow rares in this set. And maybe just about a page of hollows, unless this set is a lot bigger than I remember it being. Squirtle, Nosepass, Ryolu, Hapini, Wurmple, Pokemon Rescue, Memory Berry, Silcoon. My reverse is a shiny Lotad. Ah, uh, now I will have to go back and uh, make sure that I didn't miss any of the reverses earlier. But I think this is the first shiny. So uh, this is SH4. This was, uh, I guess you can, can kind of consider it a secret rare because it's something that wasn't listed as far as a separate number of the set. So I just dropped my shiny. Okay, shiny's not hurt. Um, but yeah. Really awesome pull. I was hoping I would pull. I don't know what the shiny pull ratio in a box is, but I was hoping I'd get one. And my rare is a Weavile G Hollow. Excellent. Uh, this is another card that was played in a lot of Lux Chomp decks to uh, counter Gengar decks mainly, mainly. Um, or Vile Guard decks, I should say. But Call for Family was uh, a great attack. Uh, 
if you were even if you weren't playing a Gengar deck, because uh, it helped you get set up. You know, it's uh, put two basic Pokemon on your bench, and that meant that was less work that you had to do going through your deck to try and dig them out. Ryolu, Krigatot, Shuppet, Electric, Chansey, Vigoroth, Mightyena, Cacturn, my reverse. Nice Pokemon Rescue. And my rare is a Beautifly. And do I have a Beautifly yet? Don't tell me this is another new non hollow rare. I do not have a Beautifly yet. That is another new one. That Look at that. That is a stack of different non hollow rares in this set. And, but now I have pulled. This is actually a really good box. Looks like I'm going to get just. A lot of nice different stuff really really uh, look good in my uh, you know making this a gem mint platinum set or close to it at least. Psyduck, Torchic, Honchkroji, Nosepass, Skitty, Lombre, Combuskin, and Galactic HQ. My reverse is a Banette. Very awesome. That That's a rare isn't it? Yeah, that is a rare. And my reverse. Nice, another Dialga. Um, I think... No, I haven't pulled this one yet. There's... Yeah, I remember there's like... Two... Yeah. Pal was thinking of Giratini. Yeah, so this is a different Dialga than the other Dialga that I pulled earlier. So, nice. So far, the only duplicate is one Toxicroak. And we've got like less than five packs left. So, that's kind of nice that I won't have a ton of duplicates um, from the box. Hapini, Wurmple, Lotad, Armor Fossil, Vulpix, Pokeball, another Rainbow, nice, and Cranidos. My Reverse is a Diglett. I like the Diglett and Dugtrio. My Rare is Dugtrio. <laughs> and I don't think I pulled a Dugtrio yet. Another new non holo Rare. Awesome. Yeah, there's just something about a little Pokemon that's nothing but... I don't even know what to call it. It's... Yeah, it's just a thing sticking out of the ground. Krikatot, Poochiana, Chansey, Nosepass, Dunsparce, Primplup, Memory, Memory Berry, and Carnivine. My reverse is a Chimchar. And my rare... <gasps> nice! A uh, Hitmonchan reprint. So this is... Yeah, this is a secret rare as well. Um, I don't know what you call the other ones other than just shiny. But yeah, so Hitmonchan reprint. Uh, number 129 out of 127. So you can consider it being a secret rare of the set. Um, honestly, I forgot about the reprints in this set. I, I knew there were extra cards. Uh, when I saw the shiny, I was just like, oh yeah, they're just the shinies. Um, but yeah, I for completely forgot about the reprints being in this set. So it's actually kind of nice to forget little details about certain Pokemon sets. Um, kind of nice. I'm, I'm intentionally not looking through my binders before I open these up, um, just so I can be surprised by what I pull. Just because you know, with fi fifty plus sets, um, you know, in in the collection. Uh, it's easy to get them all mixed up, and so it makes the openings, like I said, a lot more fun. Skuntank G, Slackoth, Tauros, Electric, Chimchar, Houndoom G, the awesome card, by the way, Lucario, and another Broken Time Space. My reverse is an Armor Fossil, and my rare, awesome, the Death in Dialga G. So another Hollow Dialga, and this was... Um, a huge part of the uh, Dialga Chomp deck. Uh, Dialga, Dialga Level X, um, the Death in Lock. It only does 10, but it prevents your opponent from using trainers or stadiums, which really hurts their setup, and especially back when... Um, I mean, we had some trainer luck decks like Vialgar and stuff, but Dialga was a card that, um, you know, you could use trainers, but your opponent just couldn't use them. So it was kind of like the Gothitel of today. Mischievous, <laughs> this is a cool looking Psyduck. <laughs> Skull Fossil, Armor Fossil, Krigatot, Houndoom G. Another broken time space. Uh, I think that's the third broken time space, so 
Uh, just just memories of that stadium being awesome. And my reverse is Galactic HQ, very nice. And my rare is Dialga. So Energy Stream Dialga, I forget if I have this one or not. Um, that may be the second duplicate of the box, um, in which case that's okay. I'm just there's so many different Dialgas and Giratinas and Palkias in this set. It's, it's I, I'm sure you can see how it's difficult to keep them all straight. Shuppet, Electric, Chansey, Wurmple, Hepini, Octillery, War Turtle, and another Cyrus. This would have been a really good box to open when this set was in rotation. My reverse is a Krikatoon, which is a rare. And my rare is, uh, I haven't pulled a Torterra yet. I pulled the reverse, but I hadn't pulled the regular one yet. So now we're on like two and a half pages, I think, of non-holo rares. This set is just insane. Oh, we're on the last pack. Uh, it didn't even register to me. So, um... Honestly, I'm really happy with this set. I've pulled two level X, a shiny, a reprint, tons of different rares, and only one duplicate so far, tons of hollows, no duplicate hollows, and uh, just awesome stuff. Electric, Skull Fossil, Chimchar, Remoraid, Grimer, Printplup, Houndoom G, Saviper. The last reverse of the box is a plus power, which is still legal today, so I really like pulling cards that uh, can still be played. And my rare, it doesn't have that cu that curve of a hollow or a level X, so it is Bastiodon. Have I? I don't think I've pulled a Bastiodon yet, unless it was like really early, but I don't think I did. So another different non, uh, non yeah, non hollow rare. And let's go ahead and give me a minute to sort all this out, and we'll take a look at the complete set and then everything I have for uh, as as spares. So this is what the complete set of the base platinum set looks like. And I'm going to go ahead and show both sides because every that way you can see everything that's in a sleeve. And that's what I pulled. Everything not in a sleeve was already in this collection before. And uh, I still have to go through and uh, just check everything to see how uh, uh, mint it is to keep in my collection. And what I need to replace. So, uh, all the hollows. I'm kind of do a, that kind of view. Uh, the rares start with Altaria, so good two page of hollows. So was able to get um, actually quite a few knocked out. You see, of six on that one, pulled ten hollows total, so pretty good. I did, I think, get a complete non hollow rare set, and the rares, those are all rares as well. So the rares end ends with Toxicroak. So I did get a complete non hollow rare set with only I think a Toxicroak extra. Pretty cool. Uh, that is the good thing about buying booster boxes is uh, it, it ensures the uh, pulling less duplicates I guess. Uh, so we start with the uncommons there, and I'll zoom in more on the pictures now because I do have a complete common and uncommon set. So there's no reason to show the sleeves. Another good thing about the boxes, I've noticed in some of the loose packs, I won't get a complete uh, common uncommon set, but you're pretty much guaranteed that with the booster boxes. So I've reorganized this a little bit, and I put the shinies down there at the bottom, and that way on this page I can show off um, everything else. So I only pulled the, the shiny Lotad, and then for my level X's, I pulled the Drapion and the Sky Shaman. And as well as a Hitmonchan reprint. So everything else um, is near mint, mint, I believe. I'll, like I said, I'll double check that. But is uh, not sleeve for now, as you can see there. And then we'll just kind of flip through the reverses. And if you see green on the back, that's what I pulled. Or I'm not sorry, not, uh, not green, white. I decided to put the reverse in white. So it's the same as the regular set. So I was able to pull a good number of. Uh, Reverses. For some reason, I have almost this entire page complete, but everything else is pretty scattered. A few here and there. And, like, nothing on that page, nothing on that page. Just a few there. And then finishing up there. So, um, like I said, good amount. I'm really happy with my pulls with this box. Overall, just uh, lots of nice things. Uh, one shiny, one reprint, two level X, and then a good variety of everything else. 
So now I'm going to show all of my extras, including what I pulled from, or what I should say, not extras, but all the duplicates I have from, that are going to be up for trade or sale, uh, including things from the box as well as things I had from this set from before the box. So here's my available ultra rares from this set. Uh, you see the Shaman and Drapion that I pulled, but I also had a Palkia and Dialga previously. Uh, same thing with the double Lotet. I had a spare recently before anyways, and so then there's the, the spare from the box, as well as a Hitmonchan spare reprint from the box. So here's quite a few hollows. More hollows. And a few more. I already had a good uh, page of hollows before I opened this uh, box. And so that means I have tons of non hollow rares. Uh, the Gardevoir is a uh, theme deck promo, but I have it in here since it's a rare as well. So that whole page as well. All of these are rare reverse. More. And more. And then we have common and uncommon reverse. And if anyone's interested in any of the regular common and uncommon, uh, just PM me. Something like uh, 25 cents each or something like that. And that's it. Uh, I'll probably leave the Rainbow and Plus Power, Life Herb, and stuff like that in here for a little while. And then I'll move that over to my uh, trainer binder since it is still legal to play. So, thanks everyone for watching, and stay tuned for tomorrow's Surprise Friday.